Girl, I should give this to the Tyler Perry Studios. Hi, ladies and gentlemen and everybody in between. I am back with somebody else's hair and guess what? It's another Amazon wig review. Oh, girl, I'm so excited for this Amazon wig review because we're gonna do a braided wig today. With my Amazon wig reviews, what I like to do is purchase a wig and do the first impressions, style the wig, all that type of stuff while we're together. I'm gonna go ahead and get into it, but before I get into this wig, I wanna ask you to subscribe and hit the post notification bell just so you can see every single time I post because I'm coming to you every single week with brand new videos, brand new Amazon wigs, all types of stuff. This video is sponsored by me, my pockets, girl. I wanted to do a braided wig because if you like me, um, my edges don't agree with braids. Girl, I lost a whole patch in the front. So I decided to invest in a braided wig and the wig that I wanted to do it's one of those boho wigs, but I'm gonna open it with y'all and I'm gonna give y'all the details on the wig, but let me show it to you first. Okay, so I bought the same top 36 inches. Girl, what am I gonna do with 36 inches? I'm only five foot three. So I got the same top 36 inch boho braid, full HD lace wig. So these are supposed to be boho box braids. The rating on this is a 4.1 out of 254 votes and it's from the store Sang Talk. So we're gonna open it together. I don't know what she look like. I don't know what she smell like. I don't know what she be like. I don't know where she hang. I don't know where her family from. So we're gonna see. So I pay $129. Did I pay $129 or so that's how much it is? I don't know, but it was $129. So we're gonna see. So this is the packaging that the wig came in. Let's see what this is about. This is the sad packaging, so cute. It's a lot of hair in here. It says Sang Talk on it, so the name matches the name on the web on the um page, which is nice. Static wigs usually don't have a smell. Okay. Oh girl, this is the oh girl, this is a lot of her. So let's start with the gifts. I'm here for this. Okay, so they give you a baby hair brush, a edge melting band, a wig cap, and a how to maintain your braided wig. Okay, girl, the girls on this car got real braids. So what are we talking about? <laughs> Okay, the eyebrow razor. Wow, that's very nice. Okay, this is the packaging. It says the style number and the color. I know y'all are like, girl, hurry up. We got things to do. I know, I know. Oh, girl, this is, okay, well, wow. Girl, this is like a deep wave with a little braid in it. It's, it's more curls than braids. I don't, okay, now this is what the hairline looks like and the lace. That's okay, it looks a little bit gray, it looks a little bit casket ready, and I don't know if it's gonna blend into my skin, but we're gonna see. So this is what it looks like inside the cap. We got one, two, three combs. We got adjustable straps in the back, and we have this elastic band that they done sewn in there. They said, whether you want it or not, girl, that's what you get. I'm trying to figure out what we can do here. <laughs> the lace feels soft, though. Um, but it has, I don't know if you can see on the inside, it's like double laced and I don't like that because it adds like a little extra layer there. That don't look right. You need one layer of lace. Why would y'all do that? My base is a wig cap and a wig grip. I use my wig grip to keep my wig cap on because my head is small. I don't know how else to tell y'all. Oh girl, I look cute in braids. Oh, this is cute. Girl, I'm gonna have to walk around the rest of the day like this. I gotta vlog today, so. <laughs> no, okay. Let me pull forward the braids. I don't know, like, I, I, it's not right, but it's okay. The braids aren't the start of the show, it's the lace. The lace is showing up front and center, and I don't like that. It looks nice, but baby, it definitely is tangling because it's giving synthetic curls without, like, why we, why do we do this? I wanna cut some of these curls out. Like, could y'all even see? Like, look at, girl, where am I going with this? At this point, I'm just looking at my booty, but where am I going with this? Y'all see that lace, the double lace? You can see it right here. That's what I need to confront. It's the double lace. Because the girls don't be doing middle parts with their braids. They be doing all of this. You know what I'm saying? And how am I just gonna be showing off y'all lace like that? Come on. Y'all really got me looking like a globe. The equator is right there. And it's lace, like, look. 
Girl, all the way to the back, girl. Okay, so I'm gonna use two lace tents because I have two problems to confront with this lace. The first problem is that the lace is still too light, but it's not like a skin tone color. So I want to tint the lace. We're gonna do the lace first and then we're gonna see what we can do next. So I wanna tint the lace first using my Kellen Derrick Lace Tint Spray. Shipping is not good. But I love the product. I'm also going to use this you can get from um, Amazon. The Eben Lace Tinted Lace Spray. Girl, this stuff is, girl, it's real. It's it's a lot. But I want um, more of a reflective sort of scalp. So I'm hoping this will balance out how dark this lace is going to look. This is going to make this lace look dark because the lace is gray. And this is going to make it lighter and more scalp-like. First, I'm going to cut off the lace in the bike. Yow, yow, yow. So I'm gonna take this lace tint and I'm just gonna spray the lace. Oh girl. I'm also gonna take a brush and I'm just gonna blend it all over. Oh yeah. Oh, this is a lot. Let me see, it's a quick dry, so hopefully. Oh, this is closer though. Okay, okay. Oh, I feel like I'm a genius, y'all. Mm -hmm. Y'all can't tell me nothing. Why are these braids stuck together? Girl, they done sewn this braid onto this braid. These are not cornrows, why did you do that? I'm gonna move along. The only thing about this lace tint is that it gets all up on the hair, it be everywhere. So next we're gonna cut the lace, then apply the wig, these Annie shears, to cut it and to apply it. I think I'm gonna use the Eben Wonder Lace Bond Spray. Wow, my fingers is dirty. But I'm trying to salvage something. I'm not one to waste a penny, a dime, a quarter, a nickel. Okay, oh, oh. Okay, so I'm just gonna cut in a zigzag. Babe, that hairline is straight across. You are gonna know where my hairline is. There's gonna be no doubt about it. No doubt about it. The way this is plopped up over my ears, I don't know. I would have to cut the cap and then cut a braid out. Like, and I don't know. This don't really, um, I might have to cut this off because the way my head is set up, it just not working. So I'm gonna have half a braid. I don't know what that is gonna do to this wig, but I'm hoping. Okay, that didn't do much to it. That's good. Mm -hmm. I have to keep punching, girl. Nobody's head is shaped like that. Nobody's head is shaped like that. Y'all really didn't think this through. Chow. Tuck that on behind the ear. Okay, now we have to apply this. And with all these baby hairs, I don't know what is going on. What am I gonna do with all those? Okay, so now we're gonna go ahead and apply the wig. I'm gonna have to like tuck these baby hairs back do something with them because they are really like, I can't really work with a plant. How did y'all do this? Um, do I wanna use the even or do I wanna use a gel? I feel like a gel is a better fit. Okay, I'm gonna use this even Wonder Lace Bond Holding Gel. I'm gonna use this because I feel like, and I'm gonna use the back of their little thing. Yeah, I feel like using anything else is just gonna be like, too much. I'm just gonna apply this to the hairline. Apparently the hairline is straight across, so don't need much creativity on that. Let's let's work through this and apply it and see what happens.
lace is too dark, like I already knew it was gonna be. But the lace is down now. It was really, really hard to apply. Like I was annoyed because it keeps hopping up on my ear tabs because there's two layers of lace. Like I don't even know why they did that. That's like the most annoying part. Two layers of lace and I looked at it in my bathroom mirror and it looks like I ain't got no scalp, girl. It's just giving very much just, seems like these braids are coming from the abyss, girl. I don't even <laughs> We gonna try and figure it out. In the meantime, in between time, I'm gonna lay down some baby hairs. Because girl, I ain't got nothing else to do, I guess. And it, they got too many baby hairs. Like how many baby hairs do you want me to have, girl? So, I'ma take my scissors and I'ma cut them down real short. Cause I do not like long baby hairs. So I have this um, lace putty sculpting gel from um, Amazon. It's from the brand uh, She Is Bomb. And I'm just gonna lay it down using their baby hair brush. Thank you for the baby hair brush, y'all. I'm just gonna lay this down. Ooh. Oh, girl, that's a lot of gel. I put a lot of gel on there. That was a lot. Wow. <laughs> okay, and I'm gonna swoop some of these baby hairs back because I'm not, no. I'm not doing that many baby hairs, no. So I'm gonna swoop some of these back. Can I like twist it around a braid or something? Because I'm just not dealing with a whole bunch of baby hairs. I feel like that looks insane. So I'm gonna take these extra baby hairs and just twist them around the roots. <laughs> Yeah, because this is not going to work for me. Twist these around the roots. It's probably going to come loose, but I'm okay with that. And I'm going to cut it diagonally that way. And we're going to lay down these baby hairs, like, on the forehead. Yeah. Y'all see where we're going with this. That's too much. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Oh, y'all, they really are burning my biscuits. <laughs> I really thought this was gonna be easy. I said, oh girl, this is gonna be cute. And what? Easy, what? It's not. But that's not too shabby, right? It's too, it's a little bit too baby hairy for me, but girl, I only got one choice. So, I'm gonna take some of these baby hairs. I'm gonna lay these down. I'm just gonna go all the way across. Let me see if I can. And I'm gonna take the extra baby hairs and wrap them around the roots so we can keep these in place and they don't pop out. Oh girl, the lace is coming up. Oh no. <laughs> Okay, y'all. So I gave up. <laughs> I was supposed to put a baby hair right here, but the baby hair on the side. Like, I don't think you'd be giving that, but maybe I should do it. I feel like it's better to leave it like loose. I don't know. Cause the, it, like the ear tabs just don't look, you know what I'm saying? Like I should just leave it like hanging. <laughs> it actually looks better in lighting. Cause in person, my husband was like, no, that lace is a no ma'am. It's the double lacing, but like on camera, it's not looking that crazy. Like it's insane. It's not looking that crazy. I feel like I need to use like a little bit of like a stick foundation to define these parts. And then girl, this is gonna be it. And um, I'm gonna tell you my final thoughts, but um, it, don't, it, look, it don't look that bad. Yeah, let me get up in this part because baby, it looks like, I don't know where these roots came from. So I'm gonna take some of my NC50 um, stick foundation and I'm gonna define these parts a little bit <laughs> so it look like something cause it really don't look like nothing. I feel like I need to add like a little bit of gel to like move this hair forward or something because I'm gonna take some of this gel and like kinda move it this way. I'm just gonna let this curl like hang out. <laughs> I'm just gonna let it hang out, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, I'm gonna let you hang out right there. Oh, 
Not a glob of gel, okay. You know what I just found on my floor? I think I found these lashes. I think this came in the bag. Cause I don't know where these lashes came from. I did not buy these, but I think they give you a set of lashes. They gave us some lashes, I think. I think this is them. I don't know where they came from. Either way, girl, let's go ahead and finish out this wig so I can go eat. I feel like this wig, if you wanna do a braided photo, but you don't wanna get your hair braided, I feel like this is a good look. But I don't know if I would spend a hundred and something dollars on this. Like, look at all this. Girl. No, and I've tried braided wigs before that actually looked good. And this one, on the roots, it doesn't look good. But as far as the hair, I think they did a pretty good job. Now, I wouldn't have as much um, curls out. Like, I feel like they, they should have skipped a braid or something. Because every single braid is uh, coupled up with a curl and I don't know if I like that. I mean like this is what we got. <laughs> uh y'all tell me what you think down below. If you got any jokes leave them down below as well. <laughs> but on video and in pictures I feel like the girls may be fooled a little bit. Like a little bit. Not too much but a little bit. It's kind of cute from here like I'm I'm living for it because I've had braids in a long time. But I'm not um I'm not sold on it and I kinda want my money back. But I can't get my money back. Girl, it's been stickified, attached to my forehead. I'm gonna have to give it my forehead too. Girl, I should give this to the Tyler Perry Studios. <laughs> like it's not bad for a photo, but oh yeah, the back. Let me show y'all the back. Babes, that's so much wig. Oh my god. That is so much wig. I probably need to close these blinds, huh? Let me close these blinds real quick. Meanwhile, y'all can look at my booty and my brace. <laughs> Mood lighting. Y'all like that? Anyways, look at that. Neck just stopped. I mean, but shout out to them having braids all the way around and not giving us a closure. So, anyways, y'all tell me what you think about this unit down below. Uh, get this thing off my head because she is long and strong, okay? Dragging this neck down. I'm gonna end up on that wood floor in the kitchen. Because <laughs> my neck is about to hit the flow, okay? Anyways, I love you all. Hopefully you enjoyed this uh, Amazon wig review. I'm gonna be coming back for more. I ordered some more wigs. So leave a suggestion for the type of wigs you want me to try out down below. I got a little budget set up just for the Amazon wigs. Y'all let me know what you want to see down below. And um, I should have put it up in a bun, but it's too much hair. Like it's just, actually I could do this. I'm gonna keep it like this. Anyways, y'all let me know what you think about this wig down below. I love you all and I'll see you in my next video. Oh.